Hi, this is Scott Parrott. Um, I'm here to uh, give you a little bit more information about uh, Jonathan Leger's Keyword Snatcher. And um, I basically, I've had some some comments about the fact that, oh, well, these are great keywords, but we really don't know uh, the specifics of them. I, and in, in my opinion, there's going to be people who really want those. They want the search volume. They want the competition. And then there are those that will just build the pages and, and trust the scaling system that's built into the software. However, you don't have to, to be, uh, you don't have to rely on trust. Um, basically, let me read this question. Keyword snatcher grabs keywords. Others do not. However, how do I determine what kind of search data comes with these keywords? Because I don't like the relative scaling of keyword snatcher. Let me show you that really um, quick. Um, with keyword snatcher, for instance, I used the, the keywords yeast infection and I hit snatch keywords and then I get back all these keywords along with um, the, the uh, rating from Google, uh, Yahoo, and Bing in this case. Ye now here's a set of keywords. Yeast infection for men is rated number one. That means this phrase has more searches than yeast infection from toilet seat. And it has half as much as more from yeast infection or uh, yeast infection fever. So it, it's a it's a relative thing. Um, the the matter of fact is is that and what's important to know is that these are actually keywords that are typed into um, the uh, Google search bar, or, uh, which is on on a page. For instance, yeast infection. If I type in yeast infection and um, start B, it pulls up all these words which are uh, suggested keywords they're suggested because somebody actually typed those into the uh, into the search bar and and in this case yeast infection bumps had more people type in than yeast infection birth control pills um, you use these keywords uh, not for be the fact that they get massive searches but because they are search down period they're long tail keywords for the most part and um, they will be bring traffic to your site because very few people will optimize their websites for these keywords. So let's take a look at, at my answer to that question. Um, I use a keyword tool called Niche Taser to grab search volume competition for the keywords generated by Keyword Snatcher. Um, Key, Niche Taser is a, a small application normally cost $17 if you use a coupon code with the, the link that's along with this video you can get it for uh, five or seven dollars and that's only up until Sunday but it's a it's a it, uh, action it's got a lot of features hang on and I'll show it to you okay and the way we work this is simply um, we grab the keywords that are generated by keyword snatcher. I'm not going to um, make the program grab all these again. Um, in this case, it's yeast infection. You click on copy keywords to clipboard, and then we take them and we dump dump them up in the keyword box up here. Now, um, what you'll want to do is is uh, have them match to phrase. You want to make sure that you don't have additional keywords checked. Um, or show ideas. Actually, show ideas is the most important. Um, and in my case, I didn't have an existing keyword, so I'm not adding these to any list I'm trying to develop. So with Niche Taser, what uh, Niche Taser, what we're going to do is um, click on Go. And when I click on Go, what it does is it gives me local volume and global volume, and that's in the first run. And as you can see, um, you can sort by these keywords, by, uh, by uh, global or local, if you're just interested in local. Or local uh, volume. Uh, you're probably going to want to go down to uh, some of the keywords in the thousand. Yeast infection, baby. Yeast infection and pregnancy. Um, yeast infection candida, um, yeast infection symptoms in men. Now, what's really cool about this is that uh, the the next phrase. So we have our search volume. The next thing that we're going to do is we're going to come to this button, which right now is in pause. Um, 
but we start off with we would click phrase and this is a go button we click go and it's gonna pull back it's gonna tell me my competition how many pages um, contain the keywords yeast infection or yeast infection and man whatever you're looking for yeast infection cure um, so now we're basically getting information from Google that tells us what the competition is for some of these keywords that uh, are being displayed from Keywords Nature. The next thing that Niche Taser does is tells us something that's really important or, or could be important to you is that it allows you to search for the all in title um, a keyword which basically means is, it, it, is this keyword keyword phrase in the uh, the title of the uh, the web page, the theory being if there's somebody optimized, it, it, when your page is optimized correctly, if you use yeast infection treatment as the name of the page. In fact, let me show you where that would be. Okay, if uh, we were looking for uh, yeast infection in men and uh, that was our keyword we could see that it's in the title of the uh, search result here and that's basically what we're looking for actually to be more specific if we go to that page go to that page and look at the title of the page top I don't know if you could see this but yeast infection yeast infection in men is the uh, title of this web page that's what all in title is going to bring back and when you um, optimize a page like this you're sending a message to Google uh, that uh, this page is about yeast infection in men and most people a lot of people don't uh, spend the extra time to, to name their page um, yeast infection in man again you could see yeast infection in man right here this gets translated to the title which is going to be right here so with the all in title information we can look at a, a keyword such as yeast infection in men and men and see that um, we have a 22 to 27 thousand searches per month however there's uh, um, this key, this phrase yeast infections in men is on 214 thousand pages on that are indexed in Google however there's only 5,000 pages that are that have the phrase yeast infection in men in the uh, um, title of the uh, of the web page so we stand a real good chance if we optimize the page correctly get a couple links to it we can end up sending our page to the first page of uh, Google so this information helps us uh, analyze the uh, the keywords a little bit a little bit better. Um, so niche taser, look at this one: yeast infection on tongue, 880 searches per month, and and uh, it has a phrase. Um, the uh, number of pages ha that this phrase is on is at only 491 uh, um, pages. So. Basically, I'm getting a little tongue-tied here, but basically why I wanted to tell you that Niche Taser is a great application that goes along with um, Keyword Snatcher that will help you to, uh, to, to build some web pages that are going to get traffic from these, um, from these keywords. So, using Keyword Snatcher and Niche Taser, you can get all the information you want.